Chapter 3 Exponents and Power Introduction We can write 5 into 5 into 5 into 5 into 5 into 5 is equal to 5 to the power 6. It is read as 5 raised to the power 6 or 6th power of 5. In 5 to the power 6, 5 is called the base and 6 is called the exponent or index of the power. The product of 5 and n is written as 5 into n. When we write the product that contains a variable, we usually omit the multiplication sign x. Therefore, 5 into n is written as 5n. Thus, 5n means 5 times n. It is customary to denote 1n as n. Sometimes a dot is used as a symbol of multiplication. Thus, the product of 5 and n is 5 into n is equal to 5 dot n is equal to 5n. In a, 2a, 3a are said to be the multiples of a. Observe that a is equal to 1 and dot a is equal to a. 2a is equal to 2 dot a is equal to 2a. 3a is equal to 3 dot a is equal to 3a and ma is equal to m dot a is equal to ma. In 25 y, 25 is called the coefficient of y. The coefficient of x is equal to 1 dot x is 1. The coefficient of minus x is equal to minus 1 dot x is minus 1. The coefficient of 49 xy is 49. Usually, the numerical part of the term is taken as its coefficient. Keeping your familiarity with the squares, higher power of integers, we ask you to observe the following. First power of 6 is equal to 6. Second power is equal to 6 square is equal to 6 dot 6. Read as 6 square or 6 squared. Third power is equal to 6 to the power 3 is equal to 6 dot 6 dot 6. Read as 6 cube or 6 cubed. Fourth power is equal to 6 to the power 4 is equal to 6 dot 6 dot 6 dot 6 read as 6 raised to the power 4 or fourth power of 6. In general, if a denotes any real number and n is any positive integer, then a to the power n is equal to a dot a dot a up to a n times. We read a to the power n as nth power of a. In a raised to the power n, n is called an exponent or index. The number a is called the base. The exponent gives the number of times the base a occurs as a factor. When a power is written as a product of factored form, it is said to be in expanded form. Laws of exponents. Law 1. Let x be any rational number and m, n be positive integers, then x to the power n into x to the power m is equal to x to the power m plus n. Example, 2 upon 3 to the power 4 into 2 upon 3 to the power 2 is equal to 2 upon 3 to the power 4 plus 2 is equal to 2 upon 3 to the power 6. Law 2. Let x be any rational number different from 0 and m n be positive integer such that m is greater than n. Then, x to the power m divided by x to the power n is equal to x to the power m minus n. Example, 5 to the power 6 divided by 5 to the power 3 is equal to 5 to the power 6 minus 3 is equal to 5 to the power 3. Law 3. Let x be any rational number different from 0 and m n be positive integers such that m is less than n then x to the power m divided by x to the power n is equal to x to the power m minus n is equal to x to the power minus within bracket n minus m is equal to 1 upon x to the power n minus m. Example, 7 to the power 4 divided by 7 to the power 6 is equal to 7 to the power 4 upon 7 to the power 6 is equal to 1 upon 7 to the power 6 minus 4 is equal to 1 upon 7 to the power 2. Law 4. Let x be any rational number and m n be any integers, then x to the power m whole raised to the power n is equal to x to the power m into n is equal to x to the power m n. Example, 2 cube whole square is equal to 2 to the power 3 into 2 is equal to 2 to the power 6 and 
3 upon 11 to the power 5 whole raised to the power 4 is equal to 3 upon 11 whole raised to the power 4 into 5 is equal to 3 upon 11 to the power 20. Law 5. Zero exponent. If x is any rational number different from 0, then x to the power 0 is equal to 1. Negative exponent. Law 6. If x is any rational number different from 0 and m be any positive integer, then x to the power minus m is equal to 1 upon x to the power m. Example. 10 to the power minus 3 is equal to 1 upon 10 to the power 3 and 5 upon 3 raised to the power minus 3 is equal to 3 upon 5 raised to the power 3. Law 7. If p upon q is a rational number different from 0 and m be any positive integer then p upon q whole raised to the power minus m is equal to 1 upon p upon q whole raised to the power m is equal to 1 upon p raised to the power m upon q raised to the power m is equal to q raised to the power m upon p raised to the power m is equal to q upon p whole raised to the power m. Example, 2 upon 3 whole raised to the power minus 3 is equal to 2 raised to the power minus 3 upon 3 raised to the power minus 3 is equal to 3 cube upon 2 cube is equal to 3 upon 2 cube.